with us, you know? Well, Uncle Poe seems to have a handle on who's causing the trouble. <sighs> That's a relief. Look, I gotta go, Jackie. Gotta see a lady about some money. With an SMG, she must have some guards or something. We'll kill them all, and then we'll get money, and then maybe the game will be nice and let me kill her. Fuck, I have one shield left. I'm gonna get, like, eight police experience. Fuck it. Hup. Hey, she, what is she You're doing? Pay up, you understand? Shit, that's a lot of muscle. Uh, how the fuck do I shoot out of a car, like, while driving it? Now I'm facing the- oh no, I'm facing the right way. Take out her backup! Uh, let's see. I don't even know if I can, like- oh shit. Ugh. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Hey, how's it going? Whoop! Ollie oop and Ollie oop! Alright. Good job. Oh, I'll get there. Apparently, I don't need to shoot to take them out. What a bunch of dickbags. Hey! Stop shooting at me! Drive slower, too, while you're at it. Oh, son of a bitch. Catch up the pa Oh, they took themselves out? What? Okay, they just gave up, apparently. They're like, oh, he got kind of past us, so forget it. Doesn't really matter. Oh, she has more backup? Are you kidding me? Yeah, come on. Come right next to me. Come on. I dare you. Oh, fuck, man. They're fucking my shit up here. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, yeah, they have, they have quite a bit of backup. That guy just left. Are they just, like, hitting and running? Is that all they're doing? They don't seem to be doing much else besides that. Oh, I'm catching up to this asshole. Hey, buddy! Come on, open the... Uh, uh, no, he's gone, too. What the fuck are... Now I can, like, lean out? That's weird. This is weird. I don't like this. Ah, fuck. Eh. Go! I gotta go. I took out the first guy, like, easy enough, but everyone else has been kind of poopy. I'll catch her. Catch up to Patsy. Stop the car without killing her. Okay. Well, ramming it should do just fine. I don't even know if you can, like, shoot. I have an SMG, but I don't understand, like, oh, shit. I was holding the wrong button. I don't understand if I can shoot it out of the car, because I'd rather just do little jumpy jumps. Well, that bus almost fucked her over. Don't turn, don't turn. Okay, good. Yeah, I'd, I'd rather just do, like, this. Oh, there we go. Hey, you got a real nice car there. Get the fuck out of the car, bitch. All right. You're coming with me, baby. Who are you? What is this? I haven't done anything. That's the problem. You old guy like rolling home money, you gotta pay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't care if you're sorry. I care if you have the money. I don't. I'm sorry. Hey, stop saying that. Sorry. Look. The car. Who has drugs in the back? That should cover my debt. Don't hurt me. I'm sorry. Whoa! Don't hurt her. She fucking Wasn't bailed. Be that bad. Oh my god. She fucking bailed out of the car. No, next best thing though. Got a car loaded with dope. All right. What I have to do. Bring it back here as soon as you can. Don't drive around in a stash car any longer than you have to. Yeah, I'm already almost there, so don't worry about that. I was, I had to have been going over 100. There's no way anyone would have lived and been happy about it after that. Because she just fucking tucked and rolled out of that bad boy. I can't even imagine doing that. That would, you would just feel so much hurt before you finally stop. Apparently, I got, like, no triad experience either, so that was pretty shitty for everything. That's great. I got a central apartment here, though. Shen, we need to meet right away! Signed, Raymond. That's fantastic. I can't believe she jumped! I've never jumped out of a moving car, let alone one going over a hundred! Raymond. Shen. Finally. Where the hell have you been? Look, I, uh, Do you have any idea what's going on? What happened at the warehouse? Raymond, do you ever actually read my reports? Your reports? All I have to do is read the goddamn newspapers. They're calling it a massacre. If it ever came out that the police were involved, we're dead. It won't. Well, you can't know that. You at least, you at least could have turned Siwa over to us. It would have helped our case. That would have put the entire operation at risk. What does Penju say? You know, he's not your handle, Wei. I am. Well, then fucking handle it, Raymond. Well, how'd you think this was gonna go down? Huh? Whatever it takes. You remember that? You wanted results, and you can't get them sitting behind a desk, nose in a rule book, with a stick up your ass. Look, Raymond, I am doing what needs to be done. No. No, you've crossed the line, Wei. I'm gonna terminate this operation. 
you can't do that. Pendrew won't allow it. Pendrew may like to take chances. I don't. And you are dangerous. Fine. But before you go back to your office to try and pull the plug, go ahead and tell Pendrew that I just met the chairman of the Sun on Yi. The chairman? <laughs> Wait, you're, you're just a foot soldier. Well, this foot soldier has just been marked for promotion because I made sure Suwa got out safely. It'll be in my report, and maybe this time you'll actually read it. So much for pulling the plug, asshole. So we met him, but nothing really happened. Nothing of significance was gained. Well, I got the central apartment, which I'm guessing is what they're showing me now. That is a pretty nice apartment building. Oh, look at this bed. Holy shit. Yeah, this place is pretty nice. Yeah, this, I could I could live here. It's like a studio apartment. Yeah, I could live here. This is this is pretty nice here. I don't know what that's a, a tub. There's no toilet in there unless that's just a big toilet. I'm guessing the toilet's in here, huh? Yep, toilet. Place doesn't have a shower, just a bathtub. What the fuck? Maybe they do things different here. I am unsure. Yeah, this place is pretty nice. Fancy dancy and all that shit. Hopefully I'm on like the first floor so I don't have to run all the way down. Up. Oh, yep, good. Thank you very much. Hey, taxi! Taxi got dead. You son of a bitch. What the fuck is that guy's problem? Can I hire the bus? Can I turn the bus into a taxi? Of course I can't. Of uh, freaking course I can't. Wow, that guy is like stopped way back here. I don't know what he's doing, but yoink. See you later, buddy. I'm gone. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm gone now. I'm sure the police are going to be fucking called over here. Uh, yeah, there's another street race there. Not quite sure I want to do another street race. Just just putting that out there. I'm not too, like, remember what happened last time in the street race? It wasn't that good. And, oh shit. This should be a health upgrade here. Did my car just, like, go all the way back down or something? Or did the door shut? There's another health thing here. I must pray to the health god. Give me health, give me health, give me health. Alright, thank you. There you go. Ask and you shall receive, because I think I just got a health upgrade. Even though, like, nothing popped up. That was weird. Well, I should have gotten a health upgrade. I don't even know why I'm checking that. Uh, upgrades, come on, go to upgrades, start. There you go. Upgrades. Health upgrades. Yeah, I should have a uh, 10% upgrade there. There you go. So I got an extra 10% health. That's not too bad. Pretty good, not too shabby. More health than I had before. I guess that's shown by the little blue bar. Kind of looks like an armor bar, but I assume that's what it is. Oh, man, are you kidding me? This place is on, like, a completely different... Oh, shit. Eh. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to do that, damn it. Stop that cab! Stop that cab! I need to use him, because I don't know where I'm going. Hey. Wow, yeah, that guy is being an ass about stuff. Yo, what's up? I'm going to hire you. Shut up. I don't know where I need to go, though. Uh, I'm there, and the other missions are, like, over here. So, and I guess I can't just get... Oh, I guess I can. Yes, take the cab to that location. How many wing wings did that cost? 310 wing wings. This guy does, like, coach tours and other shit. It was all on the back of his cab. Hey, it's that lady again. Yeah, he mentioned it the other day. Congratulations. <laughs> no problem at all, Mrs. Chu. I don't understand that. Here's my thing that I don't understand. Oh, hey, look at you. Hello, Wei. Thanks for driving me around. Yeah, no problem. So, where are we going? The flower shop. I still have to pick the color I want. You won't believe how much work it is to get ready for a wedding. We've been planning for eight months now, and there's still so much to be done. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, it better be perfect. My wedding has to be perfect. Oh, I'm sure. 
They, they had a conversation, one in English and one in, I'm assuming, Chinese. Do you have a girlfriend? <laughs> no. My life, it wouldn't be a good idea right now. Your life is why it'd be good. You have to have someone you can be soft with, too, right? Okay? It's very important. If you're hard all the time, one day you'll forget how to be soft. Then where will you be? <laughs> if you say- Where are you that going? That sounded terrible. Also- Oh god, her mood's going down. I'm gonna fail the mission because I tried to get this health thing. Fuck! Well, hey, I got the health thing, so fuck her. I don't care. Maybe I can get back and get in. I do say so. Ugh. Ugh. You are family now. Peggy, don't! I no, Peggy! You, don't like be a Winston. bitch! Peggy's being a bitch! Wedding, Peggy's being a bitch! Oh, thank god. So how do you get on with Winston's mother? Uh, she's a handful. But, you know, her bark is worse than the bite. That I know. How about her meat cleaver? That's worse than her bark for sure. No, she used to scare me, but then one day, I was having a problem with Winston. He wasn't paying enough attention to me, too distracted with work. And Mrs. Chu gave him a big lecture in front of the whole gang. I thought she might use that cleaver on him. Ever since then, Winston's been an absolute doll. And even though she still yells a lot, I know her heart is in the right place. You're lucky. My mother never liked my girlfriends. I guess it's hard for the moms. Well, I mean, you know, I used to have a thing for blondes, too. And that drove her crazy. Bad enough if I went out with a Chinese-American girl, but... But a whitey? <laughs> well, it's good to know she was loyal to her people. No, she's loyal to her prejudices, more like. That, too? Okay. But anyway, like I was saying, uh, What's-Her-Face and Wei had a conversation. One in English and one in Chinese, and... I don't know if Wei has spoken a different language yet, but to me it seems like they just didn't want to get a different voice actor for the other language that may be involved, and they just had him speak English the whole time, which makes it look really weird when one person is speaking full-on Chinese and one is speaking full-on English. Here we are. Like, I can see if, you know, Winston, he throws oh, in the so random words every again. so often. Welcome. Hey, there's a statue. Welcome. I'm here to finalize the details of the flower arrangement. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm just the driver. Now I'm just the driver and here to steal your statue that you don't earn, or you didn't earn rightfully. I'm just gonna change back and then we'll be done. Uh, actually, there is one other thing. Black orchids. This probably sounds silly, but it was my mother's favorite flower. And now that she's gone, I was thinking that I'd love to have a black orchid centerpiece. I'm afraid that's impossible. <laughs> there are none to be found in Hong Kong. Really? Well, I thought they had some down at the Garden Temple. Well, yes, but they're not for sale. The other day, the CEO of Old Boy Trading wanted one for his daughter. He told him they offered Temple 100,000.